What's up guys, it's Warhide from TrueGamerScore.com The Dragon Age Inquisition Inquisitor's Edition As well as the Collector's Edition guide With the lovely Miss K. Dizzle Hello Alright, before we start, do you want to tell them about the guide? Okay, as you can see, this is a Dragon Age Inquisition Inqu uh, Collector's Edition guide now, we were going to get the Inquisitor's Edition guide, the one that comes with the pen and the bookends and all that stuff. However, this has been delayed by customs for up to one week. So, unfortunately, we cannot get it until the, let's see, we're talking. 25th? Yeah, the 25th. They're talking ships on the 24th, arrives on the 25th. But for the purposes of the unboxing, we're going to show you the Collector's Edition. All right, and we'll actually start with the guide on that note. All right. So, as you can see, beautiful artwork on the back by Wear and EA, obviously. All right, we open it, and it comes with a map. And for the record, before we start, this does come with the bonus in-game items. Katie, do you want to tell us what those are? It comes with the Dracolisk mount. It comes with a premier ring of insight and a multiplayer chest. Because if you did not know, there is multiplayer in this one. And this are also the same DLC that come with the Inquisitor Edition guide. Yes. All right. The huge map of Thetis. And it's got the individual markers for stuff with Skyhold and things like that. Sorry, really short. Can't lift very high. <clears throat> that is going on my wall. But next. <laughs> all right. We all want to see this, but to see this, we have to get to this. Yes. By the way, that's the True Gamer Score official mascot, maybe. It's really annoying. <laughs> I'm gonna break it. Okay, there we go. Alright, and just as traditionally as every other guy, it comes with your normal insight to start with. It goes over your characters, and then it goes in about the collections and whatnot. Just your thorough, thorough uh, collection guide. Alright, here we have the game, the deluxe edition that comes with. The Inquisitor's Guide or uh, collection, which was how much? Sixty nine ninety nine for the for, deluxe edition, and yeah. with the Inquisitors. The Inquisitor's edition is one sixty nine ninety nine. Right. Okay. Same so, deluxe edition that everybody else is getting. Yes, because it wasn't too much more. I mm. got this edition. This is this is special. <laughs> All right, in the game, which looks pretty nifty. It comes with, this is the Deluxe Edition bonus perks. Flames of the Inquisition. Yep. It comes with the armor and everything else. The Red Heart, the Sky Will Throne, and the Bald Unicorn. <laughs> Did you say the Bald Unicorn? Bog Unicorn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, let's get this put up over here. And now we can start on this beauty. Bow Reptile Skin Ship. You want to help? No, I don't need to just stand it up again. Well, I don't want to just stand it up. Okay. Look at see how you see. Works. I'm just sure being careful. It's you know, careful. This is delicate. <clears throat> it's beautiful. It's reptile skin. It's faux leather, skin. or as you say, fox. <laughs> what does your fox say? All right. Here is it. I think they call it a toolbox, tool chest. Yeah, tool chest. All right. Let's open. Oh, we have a piece that went haywire. All right, go through the pieces. This is actually the in uh, Inquisition emblem, which looks pretty pretty nice. Here, let me put this back. All right, I'm not gonna take them out just for the sake of keeping things all nice and pristine in their place. But this is in. These are little. What do they call them? The little chess pieces. Little chess pieces. And then Al, the keys, and the lion, and this is actually the... Uh, Keep it so. Yes. All right. Get a good shot of that beauty. <laughs> okay. And this is the steel book that comes with the Inquisitor's Guide, or collection, sorry. We are not using this because it's too pretty. Yes, it looks... Really nice. It's 
so. she she wants me to let her have it but unfortunately it's gonna be a display piece Th this is going in our house as like a display item that's how big dragon age fans be. yeah i fangirl majorly that's my guilty pleasure all right these are the tarot cards let's start let's pull out from this side if i can get them to come out aha sis Sort of, sort of success. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> oh, they look really good too. Okay, let me just lay out a few for you. Move this over here. We have the Emperor, the Empress, the Hierophant. You know, I don't, I, I think, okay. <laughs> you said that right. I did? Yeah. Awesome. The High Priestess, the Magician, these are just a couple. And the full. Let's set that to the side. And these are what the backs look like. On all of them. Alright. I'm going to quickly uh, put all these back up. And just for the sake of me being a huge fan of Varric Tetris, he happens to be the lover on the tarot cards. Because, you know, Varric's just that awesome. Alright. Let's get everything put up. Okay, now that we have that all put up, let's go to our cute little lockpick set in its full leather-bound glory. They actually do come out. They're not made of metal, they're plastic, and think about the chew. <laughs> all right, get that put up. And there's a reason why this little feather is separate and sitting there all alone because underneath the unsuspecting steel book and lock pick set oh yeah. we have a little ink thing does not come with ink does not but you get the gist you also have two currency two gold I believe it's Orlesian coins. I believe so, actually. They have little faces on them. That's the sides. All right. And to go with your little quill and ink set, you have a leather-bound journal. It hasn't been written in. Never probably will be written in. I'll kill you. <laughs> but there's that. And you also get the cloth map of Thetis. Of Thetis. Wow. You actually need to look at that. I can see it. It looks awesome. Oh, looks like I got a new blanket. Alright, let me get this all folded back up. Carefully. Most people can't find that with a lot put. I was looking online, there's like people missing a lot, picking all kind of stuff. You remember? Mm-hmm. Okay. Get that put in here. Alright, let's get everything put back up. This is this stuff in during editing. There's another coin. That's where the coin is going. Yeah. There's supposed to be four. Oh, there's four? Mm hmm the coins are hidden, by the way, underneath the uh, leather-bound book. All right, so with all of this beautiful equipment, can't blame anyone for not wanting to try out the new awesome Dragon Age and lead the Inquisition to victory because no one wants to fall. So without further ado, I wish everyone happy gaming and good luck. Also, like I said one more time, check us out next week as we have the Dragon Age Inquisition Inquisitor's Guide. Full details later.